CSS Grid is a layout system to create grids, rows and columns, for organizing and aligning content on a page in a structured and responsive way. The Quickly Grid Builder makes it possible to capture the full power of CSS Grid without a single line of code. Visually build simple and complex layouts with areas, columns, rows, items, flows, and many more options. All Quickly blocks support CSS Grid. To apply CSS Grid, select a block and set the display to Grid. Open the Grid Builder where the magic happens. The Grid Builder is a visual representation of the block's grid. The Switch View icon switches between the Items and Areas view. The current view is signalled in the header. The Columns template displays the grid columns. To add a column, click the plus icon. The Rows template displays the grid rows. To add a row, click the plus icon. The central panel gives you a visual representation of your current grid setup. To get started, add a column or choose one of the predefined grid layouts. Add rows and columns by clicking the respective plus icon. To remove, select a row or column and click the Remove icon. To modify a column's width, select the column and adjust the width in the default tab. If you wish to set a min-max value, open the min-max tab and adjust accordingly. The Auto property lets the browser calculate the column's width automatically. It is only available when your columns do not contain any relative widths, such as fractions. To modify a row's height, select the row and adjust the height in the default tab. If you wish to set a min-max value, open the min-max tab and adjust accordingly. The Auto property lets the browser calculate the row's height automatically. It is only available when your rows do not contain any relative widths, such as fractions. The Items view allows you to directly position children where you want in the grid. To add an item, click the plus icon in the targeted cell. You can resize and move your item on the grid. Items are assigned chronologically. To remove an item, hover your mouse over its assigned number and click Remove. The Areas view allows you to define CSS areas in the grid. These do not affect children directly and can be applied separately. To create an area, click the plus icon in the targeted cell. You can resize and move your area on the grid. To rename your area, click and select the assigned name. To remove an area, hover your mouse over its name and click Remove. You can apply an area to an item by clicking on its number. The Grid Builder works in conjunction with the Settings panel. The Columns property allows you to manage your grid columns. Add a column by clicking the plus icon. To modify a column's width, select the column and adjust the width. To remove a column, click on the Remove icon. You can reorder columns by drag and drop. The Rows property allows you to manage your grid rows. Add a row by clicking the plus icon. To modify a row's height, select the row and adjust the height. You can reorder rows by drag and drop. To remove a row, click the Remove icon. The Areas property allows you to manage your grid areas. To rename an area, select the area and input the name. To modify the area's position, adjust the column and row values accordingly. To remove an area, select the area and click the Remove icon. The Items property allows you to manage your grid items. 
to modify the item's position, adjust the column and row values accordingly, following a row or column direction. To apply an area to an item, select the required area. To remove an item, select the item and click the Remove icon. You can adjust the row and column gap as required. The Auto Flow property allows you to choose how your items are placed automatically. The Auto Columns property allows you to specify the width of auto-generated columns. The Auto Rows property allows you to specify the height of auto-generated rows. The Align Items property defines where grid items are placed along the column axis. The Justify Items property defines where grid items are placed along the row axis. The Align Content property adjusts all grid content on the column axis when there is additional space available. The Justify Content property adjusts all grid content on the row axis when there is additional space available. The properties and features just mentioned apply to the grid parent. You can also apply specific CSS grid properties to children. Select a direct grid child. In the Grid Item tab, you will find all grid properties that apply. To apply a grid position to the selected child, open the Grid Viewer. The Grid Viewer gives you a visual representation of your grid and where you can place your child. Click the plus icon in the targeted cell. You can resize and move your child on the grid. The Column and Row properties allow you to manually position a child in the grid. To modify the child's position, adjust the column and row values accordingly. The Align Items property defines where a child is placed along the column axis. The Justify Items property defines where a child is placed along the row axis. You can toggle the Grid Preview by clicking the Grid Preview icon in the Block Toolbar. And that's how you build grids in Quickly.